Many of the old Western movies featured musical groups like the Riders of the Purple Sage and the Sons of the Pioneers. If you think that kind of music went the way of Randolph Scott, then you haven't heard the Riders in the Sky. <laughs> These three men, Woody Fall and Too Slim and Ranger Doug Green, yeah. sing authentic Western music. And they also host one of the Nashville Network's newest shows called the Tumbleweed Theater. Doug, what kind of a show is Tumbleweed Theater? Well, Ralph, we re bring back the great movies of the Old West every Saturday afternoon. Yep, Ralph, we run the kind of films that uh, we used to see on the Saturday morning double features with Tex and Gene and Roy, Dorothy Page, the great Eddie Dean we just saw here on the TV. Yeah, and then during the intermissions on the Tumbleweed Theater, we kind of do a little, do a little comedy and Very little. talk about the movie and its stars. Mm -hmm. Well, could we have a sample of the songs you, you do on the show, maybe? Certainly can. Let's roll one right now and show you what we do. Oh, the easy way. The, the v back back in the cowboy the saddle way. again. Out where a friend is a friend. Where the longhorn cattle feed on the lowly Jimson weed. I'm back in the saddle again I'm riding the range once more I'm toting my old 44 Where we sleep out every night And the only law is right I'm back in the saddle again Up it I I oh Rocking to and fro Back in the saddle again Saddle again. Tell them how to go back, Ranger Doug. I do 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 I <laughs> I thought the Riders in the Sky was a trio. Is this a new member of the group? Certainly not, my good man. I broke no social interchange with the wobbling Western Wahoos. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Sir Cecil Creep, late of Transylvania. You certainly look like the late something. <laughs> Silence, Christmas cow person. I'm here in my official, official capacity as the genial, amusing, and witty host of the Nashville Network's Phantom of the Opry. <laughs> Interesting title, uh, Sir Cecil. What's the show about? Oh, about 90 minutes. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Truly a rare and regrettable lapse in judgment on my part. I have taken up residence in the catacombs beneath your grand old opry house. And, oh. um, despite the twang of dulcimers, the incessant vocalizing of the mountain Williams above, I present film documentaries on the loves, lives, and culinary tastes of my sometimes subterranean companions. In other words, you host a horror movie. Uh, well, in a manner of speaking, yes, 
some of them are pretty horrible. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Perhaps you'd like to view a charming little vignette that shows my arrival at the dank and dismal din of decadent discord. Lights, <laughs> camera, action. <laughs> In the dark, dank catacombs beneath the Grand Ole Opry House in Nashville, Tennessee, we join our host for this evening feature, the Phantom of the Opry, Sir Cecil Creep. Mr. Durham has got to clean this place up. <laughs> and now, friends, I must say good night to Woody Paul, to Ranger Doug, to Too Slim, and to, to Sir Cecil Creep. <laughs> Could I please hear it for all these gentlemen? <laughs> We'll be back with more of Premier Night right after this. This is the Nashville Network. 